Remember Tiffany Montgomery? Yo. I remember. Familiar with her? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, well, she called someone else a witch. To these United States of America, the Lord says repent. Repent. To these United States of America, the Lord says repent. Our very first cover by God was 2020. It was election year. And I released the word of the Lord from that stage and I said, the Lord told me to warn you, don't vote blue no matter who. And don't vote red just because they said. But that you will need the gift of discerning of spirits and the ability to judge according to righteous judgment and not according to appearance, according to John 7:24. The lady is a witch. You vote her in, we're ushered into quicker judgment. Take that up with God. <laughs> Take it up with God. Get him, Tiffany, get him. <laughs> There's a reason why God had me <laughs> rebuke the body against going to the concert of a high level witch. Oh. Witches stay now, together. I'm just <laughs> Trump might not be the answer for all of us. I ain't too fond of him, neither. He scares me a little bit little unhinged a little <laughs> but I don't know how many of you studied Cyrus in the Bible but apparently Cyrus was a bit like Trump a little bit unhinged the Bible says in Ezra 1 1 that because of a proclamation Jeremiah made 400 years ago when Cyrus was in office the Bible says the spirit stirred up the spirit of Cyrus and he began to do what God told him to do. So you can't go off of what it looks like or how you feel. You have to ask God who is the choice you want me to vote in so that judgment is slowed down. And I'm gonna say it one more time. If you vote the wrong person in, judgment will be expedited. It is not God. That woman is not God. Ah. Mm. Uh, okay. Um, Benetism. <laughs> so she's saying Kamala Harris is the witch. Benetism. And uh, she, vote for Trump. Ryan? I'm, I'm trying to figure out, right? Like. <laughs> Y'all got to keep that same energy y'all had with Beyonce. Mm -hmm. Keep that same energy y'all had with what she said Beyonce. What, is, what, is she, what has she done to prove she's a witch? That's what I'm trying That's to That's my thing. Beyonce is kind of obvious it's, to me. That's what I told you. Yep. I was just having this conversation <laughs> with my mom. I said, Beyonce is obvious. It's, it's, in, it's imagery out there that supports it. And my mom was just like appalled. She was like, she called her a witch? What? What'd she do? Oh, your mom Your mom heard this or the Beyonce? I was telling my mom. She asked oh, me you what, told her. I was uh, driving in and she said, what are y'all talking about on the show? I told oh, her. Oh, wow. Dope. Yeah, I told her and she was okay, like. Okay, support. Just, okay, mommy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, um, <clears throat> so let's, let's unpack this part where she says judgment will be slowed down or sped up, right? Mm hmm <sighs> What is she saying by that, right? Because I'm <laughs> I'm all for the king coming as soon as he wants to come, um, and if we got to destroy the earth in order for that to happen, let's. I'm just kidding. I'm going. No, you're not. But I'm saying like. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're not. <laughs> yeah, but I'm saying like that's the part no, I need to know. I need not. to. Wh where's the proof? What is what, what are we talking about? That's what I want to know. That's what I want to know. Where's the proof? Right, right, right. Because I mean, He's like, struggling. my mom reminded me as I was driving in, like, all the stuff that Trump has done and all the stuff that we are against. Um, yeah. you oh, know. it's a family thing. Oh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's a family yeah. thing. It's a family full of people that said. But now I'm just like. So can you go back to your mom's house and say, Mom, I just, I'm sorry, I voted for Trump. She said, she'd be like, don't come back to my house. Oh, yeah, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> for sure. For sure. Jesus. For sure. I mean, we might be able to have a conversation still if it was Mitt Romney on the ticket and I did that. She'd be like, okay, well, whatever, but not yeah. Trump. I, I do I do have the same question. When she when she called Beyonce a witch, she had a bunch of reasons why. Did she ever explain why she's saying this? 
about she come, said come on, because you're you're voting for the person that no bring, but but why does she think she's a witch no she didn't explain that part. Uh, another That's video i saw they were talking about the origin of her name her background her family things of that nature they were saying that it's people in her family who practice witchcraft and she was raised in that and they kind of swept that under the rug, and she's saying that she don't have nothing to do with it. That's what that's something that I saw. The Indian side or the the Indians, Jamaican Indian black side, side? Indian side, which being Native which, American, I mean, which would make sense because a lot of yeah, a lot of that stuff over yeah. there is like they got a like multitude of gods. Yeah, witchcraft. Mm -hmm. I just need. I, well, she's I, not I, Native American. Her mom is no. We're talking about like, like in India from overseas. Yeah. yeah, yeah, but you okay? India. All right, gotcha. Yeah, gotcha. Yeah, yeah she's hmm. East Indian. Yeah. So, um, mm -hmm. yeah, I would need her to explain why. Or she may be talking about the Jamaican side, you know. Ooh. That's what I'm worried about. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take some time to. I I've been, gonna say it. I I've been hearing it. a lot of ridiculous stuff. I was gonna say a lot it. of ignorance about Jamaica floating around. Um, <laughs> that y'all ain't black. Y'all ain't black. I'm like, wait Listen. a minute. Do, do people not understand how the cops know you're not black? When <laughs> you ain't wanna ride around. When the ships <laughs> floated over here, That's they funny. dropped us off first. First, I think, I and think, then they drop y'all. I think off. it's a big. We're from the same place. I think. It, I right. think it's the same. What are y'all yeah. talking about? I yeah. think it's the. I think it's a thing where a conversation that needs to be had is about African Americans and people from the islands because I think people they it's always assumed that we don't like each other. We don't get no, along. No, that's not true. No, I'm just saying this is what's being said on the internet. It's like yeah. like people think Jamaicans and. Hate Haitians or people from other islands are better than African Americans. That this they call us and lazy. Well, they do act like that it though. From, yeah. they, they call us yeah. lazy, and I hear yeah. that from Africans. Like, in the Africans, they, yeah. 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 yeah, say that about African Americans, but I don't hear that is Jamaican not American. true. Yeah. <laughs> Jamaicans, Jamaicans are black. Um, of course. Same kind of black as y'all. Fought slavery just like y'all. Yep. Everything is exactly like the we same. Yeah. Um, so I, I I just don't like our internal because that yeah. is a long running yeah, battle between not just Africans and American black people but black people and, and the whole diaspora. Yeah. There's this 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 beef that happened and now y'all are letting white people have this beef in front of y'all and and co-signing it. No. Ridiculous. No. That, yeah. Cut That's that out. Stop. Ra uh, race was created by uh, white people that were trying to profit off of slavery and. You guys are letting them decide. Okay, so now you're black. No, now you're not black. Now you're right. black. Now you're mm -hmm. right. It's ridiculous. Anyway, why is she a witch? Right. Okay. Why is she a witch? <laughs> I was gonna comment on that. Uh, I would say oh, no, this. No, no, you know. <laughs> no, I was gonna comment on the the black thing because like being from Miami, you know, we all mixed up down there, and there's so many different cultures. But as far as being African American, black is more of culture. So it's like Jamaican. Haitian, we all have different cultures, but the African American culture and experience is a little different. So we're black in hue, but not necessarily in culture. Well, that's the way we look at it. But black, black is black is black. Yeah, it is. African American, you could say, is distinct, but people call people black wherever you come from. Yeah, you're black. Yeah, so, and black people get the same treatment. No matter, they don't ask you where are you from. You're just black. Yeah. yeah, you know what I'm saying. So you say African American is different from like the Haitian Jamaican thing, but black is universal. If well. you get pulled over, you black. Yeah, nobody's asking sure you where, where, where where's true. your mama from. Yeah, you're just black. So yeah, there are different cultural differences. There's cultural differences between people in Georgia and people in California, but yeah. we're we all get treated the same way. So I, I just don't like that fight. That that's right. crazy. But why is why is she being called a witch? Like I, why is she doing that? I'm gonna say this. I. I'm careful on politics because I don't really care for her or Trump being real. Um, but I don't think she necessarily a witch where she doing spells and ooh and all that kind of stuff. But I look at some of the way she the way she handles things, the way she does things, some of the things she says. She she comes across as very disingenuous to me. Um, That's politician. Though. Yeah, very. Dis <laughs> yeah, I was about to say she's a yeah. politician. She very disingenuous. Y'all think um, she was spirit cooking? She said the one statement <laughs> oh, <God>. she made <laughs> about Maybe. the uh, population control and stuff like that, <laughs> and then just to insult black people's intelligence, um, the way she just did at the Democratic National Convention, you got Megan Thee Stallion up here twerking. That was, that a, rally. was a rally. That was just a rally. That was a rally. Man, you shouldn't have been but, here. Period. Here's my thing. Here's my thing. I would say. I would say. I could probably get over the the Meg the Stallion situation before I could get over Trump saying that black jobs are being taken. Both of them are ignorant, but this is what I'm gonna say. Yeah. Both of them are ignorant, but the thing is, it's the insult of the uh, insult of our intelligence for me that I didn't like. So you're pretty much saying if I get a rapper up here that y'all liking, y'all revere, I'm gonna get the young black vote. 
but we're educated. We know what's going on. We 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 understand policies and legislation and things like that. Like come to us and let us yeah. know what are you going to really do for people. Don't come up here with a rapper that's going to twerk in front but, of us and think that's going to draw us. I in. think what she could have done. I'm sorry, but what she could have done was she could have had her come up and say, "Listen, I want you to talk to the people." Because I think the difference is, I think people wouldn't people would have been mad that you had Megan Thee Stallion here, but I think people wouldn't have been as mad if you heard her speak and just talk about her policy. Like she she just she just did something recently where she was in um, Chicago for um, um, Lollapalooza and Megan Thee Stallion, and she talked from there. So that's what I'm saying. If she just if they let her do what Amber Rose did at the Republican National, just talk versus do a concert and you start you start twerking. Yeah, like, it's just disrespectful. And then. I don't agree with Trump on 99.9% of anything he says, but I ain't gonna say that, but he uh he had a point. They showed a video where she was like she was not claiming to be black. Yeah. But that's fine though because she's in a video with her mom who is Indian. So she's you know what I'm saying like she's cooking a meal and so she's like because I'm Indian. Okay, let me cuz uh, y'all are really getting on my nerves with this just <laughs> Jamaican people we're not are talking from, about the no, Jamaican, but they are oh, still the talking about it in the chat. Okay, okay. Jamaican oh, okay. people are from Africa. Mm -hmm. It's a mixture of natives, Africans, Indians, Chinese, Irish, all in the same place. But the slaves from Africa, the same West Africa y'all are from, mm -hmm. were dropped off in Jamaica. The Maroons yeah. fought back against the people that were enslaved yeah. there. That's why the country is predominantly black. To the chat, you are not going to win this argument against Sean. He knows his stuff. It's, it's, I mean, it's, 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 it's not like you got some Adolf's people in the chat. But, yeah. but, but, but what, what people don't like. understand is there is a large, the food, it, you just look at the food. The food yeah. is a combination of all those different places I mm -hmm. just mentioned, right? So there are Indians there, East Indians, right, yeah. that live there. So that culture is infused into the culture as mm -hmm. well. So having an Indian person married to an African person in Jamaica is mm -hmm. common. That's, mm -hmm. that's not, yeah, that's is, not yeah. abnormal. A lot, no, of, the I, I, a lot yeah. of the Caribbean islands. I'll say this. I think, I think what she, I think what a lot of people are feeling, and I just, just seeing stuff online, I think people feel like when it's almost like when you with certain people, you're this way. And then when you with these people, yeah. you're this way. It's mm -hmm. like, just be yourself. You conveniently trying to, yeah. whoever yeah. you around, you kind of morph into like, now nah, I'm super black now because yeah. I'm in yeah. here yeah. trying yeah. to get a young black Black vote. people you know like, I, we see through that. Like, just be you. Yeah, if it's you, just phony, If you're bro. saying you're Indian American, just say, hey, I'm Indian American. I'm a woman of color. Just but, be okay with that. But I, yeah. but that's what, okay. they, that's but what the, they were saying. Okay, so I... I understand what you're saying, but the argument that they're using is when she said that she was the first Indian American to be yeah, in yeah. the Senate, whatever. If that's true and that's your claim to fame, you're going to say that part. Yep. Right? Yeah. Right. Yeah. You're yeah. going to highlight the part that yeah. you are Asian. Right. Yeah. Because you were the first to do. You weren't the first black person yeah. to do yeah. it. So you're not going to talk about that part. Yeah. You were the first Asian to yeah. do it. Mm -hmm. Right. So th this whole race part is, is yeah. really making yeah. me mad because like it's very common for there to be black and asian mixed people in jamaica yeah that's but true they're, they're still black they're black people yeah I'm it's so true it's just that she's emphasizing it more it's like when she's in the setting with these young black people like you're right she's she's color she's black but but she's black but it's like when i'm in this group of people over here now all of a sudden now i'm blackity black 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 you know what i'm saying <laughs> i mean she's she's definitely, she's definitely black, 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 yeah. huh? yeah, i was about to she say she's blackity black black it's a black yeah, okay. Okay. she's a black color yeah, so so she's black. i'm gonna try and get off this race stuff why is she a witch <laughs> That, Where's the I witch don't stuff coming? She cold know switching. Either. She cold switching, man. <laughs> no. Why is no, she? No, I think Tiffany is. I think Tiffany is making a reference to the thing she believes in to be witchcraft. I, I just but. hope that she's not referring to my people as being witches just because they're from Jamaica. No, 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 no,
you're you're gonna alienate people what are yeah, you doing what yeah. are you doing yeah. but then i'm like i look to the other side and i'm looking at trump and i'm like this dude is the worst person i've ever seen in my life <laughs> yeah what are yeah. we supposed to do <sighs> i think i think it goes back to like you know how you ha- you you work it, like you go to a job and you don't like the boss and the boss is mean and whatever but you got to deal with that situation i know you, we choose the boss we choose the boss but i think sometimes people be like 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 I, I know, like I choose that. I, you, if you choose one person and that person is more lenient, they doing whatever you like them, they chill with you. But then when it's when time when rubber gets the when rubber meets the road, it's like, ooh, that person can be trustworthy. That person can be that versus the mean dude that's like that that gets you straight, gets get you straight and narrow. But you like, I don't like his attitude. I don't like right. his stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. But you get the best results. Maybe, maybe you get the best results from that person. But you just, you just in your feelings about I don't like how he talk to people. I don't like how you. My thing with Trump that. is at least I know what I'm getting. That part. Like when I look at Trump, there's no mystery of who he is or what he's gonna do. Like I know who Trump is. This Kamala, well, Kamala, I don't, I don't know. You know, so I don't know what she's gonna. You do. got, you know, the Trump of first term, but you don't know the Trump of a second term. And Trump of a second he, term, but all I can go off the body of work that he has. <laughs> pre- that's all we can go off of. But, but everybody, with, with Kamala, she she ain't really got a good track record though. Yeah, I mean, I'm but she's been in for four years. But yeah. I'll say everybody, yeah, same as Trump though. Everybody's gonna be a little bit more relaxed and try to get away with more in their second term. That's why he's talking about a dictator on day one. Um, and doing crazy stuff like that part is the scariest part to me like an unhinged Donald Trump with nothing to lose and nobody to remove him but look at this though just the same people who came out with Biden came out and said if you don't vote for me you're not black how a 70 year old white man gonna tell me if I'm black or not (laughs) This is the kind of ignorant stuff they do. You got somebody twerking at your convention. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You got, you know what I'm saying? It's like both of them are insulting our intelligence, but at least with Trump, I know this is a a, a dude with no integrity, probably <laughs> but terrible we character. He lost me already. He, he going he, he to say some crazy thing, stuff. But what president is selling your Bible? Exactly. That's what I was thinking. I really think no. he just say what the rest of them yeah, are thinking. He, he really said, he really a gangster. I'll be honest with yeah. you. like He really a real, a real live gangster. I don't too much care for him, but he a real live gangster. I'd rather deal with somebody who I know. It's like racism. If I go in Mississippi, I know they don't like me. So, by certain places in Mississippi, yeah, you know they don't like you. I'd rather go there and know what's up than go somewhere where they're smiling in my face and then, you know what I'm saying, that's the, you know, Here's my one. issue with the politics stuff. I don't like the fact that Trump and a lot of the people that are there now in the Republican Party use Christianity as like a like a like a bargaining yes. tool with you. Like yeah. they take advantage of your Christianity. Yeah. I do not like the fact that Democrats, including Kamala Harris, uses blackness as a bargaining tool yes. to get you to feel bad yeah. about stuff and get you to want to vote for them just mm-hmm. because you're black. Mm-hmm. I don't like either one of those things. Problem is, I'm a Christian first, so it really bothers me that people use Christianity that way. Yeah, yeah. that's ridiculous. I mean, Obama did go to the go to a black church and sing. But what <laughs> policy? But you look at policy wise, you the stuff that Trump done talked about so far. And once again, I'm not I'm not advocating for him. I, I, I really hate these kind of discussion. But um, what kind of policies that he came out with that you can look at and say, oh man, that's really going against Christians or going against the faith? Like he really don't have. Nothing. I mean, if, if if there's any truth to it, which I don't believe there is, this Project 2025, I don't he said he got it. nothing to do with it. If it is, it is definitely going to hurt a lot of a lot of people. My my issue with Trump even more so recently is he's been backing off the abortion stuff. So the only yeah. advantage he had, he's been backpedaling. People, yeah. so there was a young lady that asked him directly about abortion. He's like, "Oh, we gotta, you know, we gotta, he we gotta win elections. It's not working <laughs> for us, you know." I'm like, "What are you talking but about?" He, he also said too. He said, um, "He said I I support." Someone, you know, when if it's a life, if it's a life changing situation, or that's what I'm saying. He's, lo- the rate. he's losing so ground he's, on that. Yeah. What I'm saying is, I I was on, I was on picket lines. I was with the people fighting for pro life, the pro life movement. The stuff he's saying now is not what they want. Mm-hmm. It's not. It's a backpedal, and I, that's like, why are you doing that? That was your only advantage to me. So y'all vote for whoever you want. There's people on our team. That are voting for Trump. There's people on the team voting for Kamala. There's there's people on our Carnell team. Yeah, not voting. Say they will vote for Trump yet. 
Yes, they, yes, you have. I heard you might say they were voting for Trump. Yes, you, you must have. not but read. Let me the, ask you this. You must not read the what's the name. What? Don't, you don't read don't, the group chat. I don't pay attention. Yeah, to yeah you don't. Well, let me let, let me say let this. me say what I'm saying. There's <laughs> there's people that are voting for Trump on our team. There's people voting uh, Kamala Harris on our team, <clears throat> and there's people that's not voting on our team. So you guys make up your but, own okay. mind. Okay. For the for the record, Wait, real quick, I want to put this question out. West? Nobody, Cornell, y'all not going to vote for the record. I'm serious. For the record, in the let's, comments. let's be serious. I'll for the record, I'll, 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 I'll vote for, for the record, I, I want y'all to answer this, right? Because this, what, the question is for the record: What do Christians do? Because I'm telling you, I was on D1's um, live last yeah. week, and vote, shout out to on. D. He he said he was going to come through, um, and he was like, you know, this is about the person and not the policies. And if y'all think it's about the policies, then it is what it is. He lost a lot of followers, and the chat was going crazy, yeah. like crazy stuff yeah i think so what yeah. are christians supposed to do what is the advice that we're given everybody got different advice some yeah. of these people saying vote for trump some people saying vote for kamala yeah, a lot of black some people, people saying don't trump. vote i'm going to my prayer closet <laughs> right be locked in you know you're going to trump playing if man. i ever put it like this you put a gun in my head and i had to vote i would vote for trump before i vote for kamala yeah that's it that. <laughs> I, will, I, will, I will vote for Trump. I vote for Kamala. I, I just like to know what I'm you dealing say, with, man. Is that, is that what, what it is? I just like I just I just like to know what I'm dealing with. I just I, I don't know. Every, I already said what I said. Ain't no way you with her. Ain't I'm not saying I'm with her. I'm saying ain't no way I'm voting for that man. I have object permanence. I understand that just because somebody pretends to be some way now, I remember what you did, brother. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I remember how you acted when you got it. Yeah, <laughs> ain't no way. Yeah, they revolted. Vote they for attacked whoever, the White House. All that. I remember. That vote, vote for whoever yeah. you want. Not me. Not me. No, sir. All right. Let's move off of that. <laughs> <laughs> that was fun.